Have you been looking for a small, super bright, everyday carry flashlight but want something a little bit bigger than your typical keychain light but don't want to carry something as big as this? Well this light might be perfect for you. This is the S10R Baton from Olight. It's only 2.7 inches long and packs a powerful 600 lumens. Let's check it out. Alright, so here we have the Olight S10R Baton. This is a third generation. Uh, when you order it, this is the box that it comes in. Nice plastic box. Definitely makes you feel like you're buying something high quality. It is a, a rechargeable light with a max of 600 lumens. It is waterproof. Let's see, on the back side, we'll check out some of the specs here. Uh, like I said, 600 lumens high has a drop down of 300 lumens. The medium is 120, the low 12, and the moonlight is half a lumen there. So let's open this thing up and see what comes in the box. All right, let's see here. We have a warning, do not short circuit, otherwise may cause dangerous accident. Read me. Before first use, unscrew the tail cap and take off the insulating film. Okay. All right. <clears throat> All right. So here they include a nice little patch. Has a Velcro on the back of it here. This is the charging cable for it. It looks like it is a micro USB charging cable. There is also a lanyard for the light. The instruction manual. We have a charging dock. And we have the flashlight here. All right, so here are the items that are included with the S10R Olight bundle package. Check that out, guys. This is a super small flashlight. Very nice. All right, so first off, let me remove the film on the flashlight that way we can get this thing going you guys can see the battery is included it is a RCR 123A battery comes included with the package so that's really nice alright let me make sure it turns on okay alright so the housing on this it is made up of some kind of aluminum it does have a pocket clip there is a tiny, tiny little hole there, if you can see it, that is made for the lanyard, which it is also included. It is a nice lanyard, an adjustable lanyard, so you can uh, stick your arm in there, tighten it up, that way you, you're not losing the slight. The bottom of it here is magnetized as well as the base here, so when you put it on the base, it sticks right on there. It's not going to fall over. Even if it were to fall over, most likely the battery the light will continue to charge. But the base does have suction cups, so if you're able to stick this maybe like on a nightstand or something, then it should stay pretty nice in place there. All right, so as far as the charging base goes, it has one indicator light. It will be red when it's charging, and it'll turn green once the light is fully charged. As far as the magnet goes, it, it does feel fairly strong. If you guys can see that, it doesn't seem like it'd be falling off like maybe if you if you're working on your car you can stick this on the on the hood of your car or pretty much anywhere metal you know and it's going to pretty much stay in place all right so let's go over the modes here there's one button so if you hold this button for over a second it turns on to the moonlight mode i don't know if you guys can see that on camera hold it down for another second it switches over to the low mode which is 12 lumens Hold that down another second. This will be the medium mode, which is 120 lumens. And then hold it down again, and that is your 600 lumens. All of these modes, there is a memory on them. So whatever mode you had it, had it on, when you turn the light off, when you turn it back on, it will go back to that mode, except for the, the bright mode. If you have it on the 600 lumens and you turn the light back on within 10 minutes then it will go back to the 600 lumens but if it's been longer than the 10 minutes the light will automatically switch to the medium mode now there is a couple quick features on here say for instance you have it programmed to be in the medium mode but this when you turn it on you want to get directly to the high mode you just hit that button twice really quick 
and it goes directly to the 600 lumens. Alright, so as far as being on the bright mode, all lights like this have a step down mode, meaning after about a minute and a half of being on the 600 lumens, this will step down to 300 lumens and that will run for another 60 minutes. Uh, another cool feature that this has, it does have a strobe mode. In order to get to the strobe mode, you hit the light three times quickly, one, two, three, and it takes you directly to that strobe mode. All right, so overall, this is a very nice, powerful light. It is small, it is perfect for EDC carry. You can carry this in your pocket without noticing any weight in it. It is super bright when you need it to be, but you can also use it if you just need a dim little light around your house or it has a lot of options when it comes to the type of lighting that you need. I do very much enjoy that it, they included the charging base because you can just stick this on the, your nightstand every single night, wake up, and you know that it's fully charged. You're not going to have to worry about it, you know, dying on you when you're going to need it. All right, so first impressions of the Olight flashlight is it's a very nice, well-built flashlight. Um, definitely feels high quality. It does feel like this is something that I would use for many years. So overall, I'm pretty impressed with it. Just the build quality alone, you know, it feels very solid. So later on, I will do a full on review of how it's worked, how it's been over time. So if you're in the market for a small EDC flashlight that's super bright, uh, look no further than this one. This is the S10R Baton from Olight. All right, so that was it for today's video. Hopefully this video helped you out a little bit if you're looking into buying something small, EDC carry. Let me know in the comments below if you like the light, if you're planning on picking one up. Give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, and we will see you guys on the next video. Peace out.